Shalom me homies and welcome to another speed paint. This week we're going to be doing a sort of request that I got over a discord right in this point art server that I'm in. Today we're going to be drawing uh, Medusa and Dracula in kind of a standoffish battle sort of thingy. This is, I haven't really done a uh, two character, well I mean I guess with the, with the Holy Week speed paints I had like a lot of characters but I never really like had a battle scene, I don't think, on this channel. Yeah, at least not on this channel. Like, I've had some before. So this is kind of a new thing for me. Uh, I guess the first thing to point out is that like I, I don't know how hands work, and I probably won't know how they work until I, you know, practice them. But here is um, how it's going. So uh, Medusa is obviously in the background where Dracula is in the foreground and they're going to be they're in this like kind of Greekish setting this like destroyed Roman te Greek temple it might be the temple of Athena uh, if you know Medusa's uh, mythology you'd understand why that'd be so yeah Yeah, I don't know how hands work at all. Um, so... <laughs> this is what we get with hands. Right now we're working on Dracula. And... Honestly, I haven't inked in a while, so I still need to... Get back into the swing of things with inking. His cape was pretty fun to draw. I don't have too much to comment on right now, sorry about that guys. Uh, getting into the background here, um... I want to make the night sky kind of like... Not super dark, I could have made it darker, I like purple more for my night skies. I could have gone more with that, but here, here's what we got in the end. I need to work on backgrounds, like specifically like the actual ground, uh, making it less... 2D and more 3D. Right here, things are starting to lag out a little bit. Um, I don't know why. Um, my computer's not that overloaded. I hope. Um, but like you can see, like the shift was holding. Was like, yeah, English. I was holding down shift, or like I wasn't even holding down shift. It acted like I was, so that was weird. And like some other things, like it was lag a bit, but I don't know, it kind of fixed itself later on. I just maybe just need to close a couple things, you know. I actually really enjoy drawing pillars. Um, but yeah, those are pretty fun to draw. I don't know why. <laughs> I guess that's like the one thing I'm good at with uh, backgrounds and stuff. I like doing structures, those are always pretty fun. And some nature scenes. Uh, I probably will do some more later on. So I guess about the actual battle. Oh yeah, here's the moon. Yeah, pretty spicy. <laughs> So I guess about the actual battle, I guess like how this would, how would this work? Um, I guess like, hmm. So Medusa's a uh, Greek Roman, and uh, Dracula is, well he lives in Transylvania, obviously, but like, a uh, British novel, I think? American film, Bela Lugosi, my boy. Um, yeah. I don't know how they'd meet, I guess, like, maybe... Ooh, what if, like, um... When they were, like, taking Dracula back to the... To the Americas, or back to Britain. Uh, depends on where you look at it. Um, what if they, like... What if their ship, like, end up crashing in Athens or something? And... I don't know, I guess Medusa would just be chilling out here, you know, and then be like, Hey Dracula, we're gonna square off now. 
I feel like, I personally feel like, uh, Dracula, I don't think, like, that either of them would actually win. Dracula would probably, like, escape, though. Um, I don't know how the whole turn to stone thing would work with, uh, already an undead creature. I mean, it's probably still turn to stone. That would make sense. I feel like Dracula would, like, try to escape and stuff. I mean, it's interesting, they both have things with mirrors, like, uh, you could look at Medusa through a mirror, because you can't turn a mirror to stone. That's the common thing I see. Uh, but you could, but with Dracula, can't, vampires can't see their reflection in some lore. Uh, so, that's kind of interesting. Ooh. We're getting into the shading now, and the shading, uh, I actually kind of like how the shading came out. That was pretty cool. Uh, I don't, I want, I don't want to go full soft shading, I want, I should have kept with like some of the, uh, more cell shadingness. But yeah, I remember thinking about unicorns right here. Anyway, <laughs> random side note. <laughs> but yeah, um, I guess like, Dracula would accidentally end up in Athens somehow, and they would meet up at night, uh, by chance. Like, I guess Medusa and her Gorgon sisters would be, uh, I guess, defending uh, what would be their home at this point because, I don't know, like, they don't really have anywhere else to go. They've just been existing for, um, like, thousands of years. They just kind of chill out here. Thousands or hundreds, both, I guess. If you don't know Medusa's story, you should check it out. I'm not going to go too much into detail with it here, but it's pretty interesting. You got all the stars in the background. I personally like um, doing the stars myself instead of like uh, having like a spider tool or whatever. I don't know, that might just be me. Yeah, we're just about finished here. I hope you enjoyed this video, and until next time, stay tuned for more art. See you later. Bye.